have this alleyway scene here which I made with the help of some photo scans. You can get this project file for free on my Patreon so you can follow along. Make the world dark, relocate the cursor, add a sunlight, move it to the top, change the pivot point, and now we can rotate it easily. Make sure you follow the rule to avoid the light to come from the camera side. I always go with 45 or 60 degrees. Rotate it around on Z axis until you get something good. Increase the strength and click use nodes. Increase the emission strength as well and add a black body node. Set it to 4,500 Kelvin and you are done with the main light. To fill these dark spots, switch to the world tab in the shader editor and add an HDRI. Try to match the HDRI sun with the main light. This will create perfect shadows and we are almost done. Push the HDRI with the math node set to power and decrease the value to 0.1 or 0.2. Now this is where the secret source comes in and it is right under the color management tab. You can play with the exposure to get good results. Let me explain the concept first. This is Uncharted 4, one of my favorite games. Notice something? The exposure changes and it makes a big difference because you can't show both shadow and sunlight at the same exposure. You have to either decrease it to normalize the sun brightness or increase the exposure until the dark spots look normal. You can do this in the compositor as well. Just add an exposure node and decrease the exposure. I usually do minus two or minus one. Add some glare and softness with the filter node and you are good to go. If you want to push it one step further, try the cinematic compositor. It will add some cinematic touches which will boost your render visuals. There is also